what is going on everybody so a bit of context to the next video um, I met Harry had a flat battery I went and gave him a quick bump start with the truck so it's really rude of me having earphones in uh, and then next thing I know we're driving to the Suzuki dealership and um, this is uh, the new Suzuki Jimny So, we are in the new Suzuki Jimny, anticipated car. There we go. I'm not used to this because I drive a Defender, but I'll tell you what, this car is absolutely fantastic. I'm so impressed with this little 4x4 animal. If you think my Defender is like a lion, this is like a, a mad feral pussycat that has just got off-road capability. It's like driving a mini G-Wagon, and I, um, I am thoroughly impressed. So, yeah, this is it, the new Suzuki Jimny. It's got, this is a top spec model, admittedly. So it's got all the sort of jazz and bells and whistles that you'd expect. Five-speed box, um, yeah, it's quite comfortable. Uh, what else? I mean, yeah, there's plenty of room in the back. I wouldn't want to be small, but, it's just, yeah, it's quite comfortable. For a little 4x4, it, 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 it's, you know, it can't be beaten. And um, yeah, I'm, I am thoroughly impressed with this. This has only done 73 miles. It's that new. It's still got the whiff of new car smell, which is fantastic. And yeah, I mean, we're cruising quite happily at about 65, 3,500 RPM. The sound system's good in it, not that it's on at the moment. Um, yeah, and it's, it's, it's quite comfortable, it rides quite well. I'm, I'm thoroughly impressed, fair play Suzuki. I would love to take one of these off-road and, and compare it to the uh, to the Defender, but yeah, I'm, I'm so far as an, an on-road car, I'm thoroughly impressed. Any negatives? Negatives, it's revving a little high, that's the only thing but it's geared so you can do better off-road. Um, but I mean, apart from that, I, 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 I've got no no complaints to it. No complaints whatsoever. And size-wise, how's it compared to a Defender 90? Defender, this is probably the sort of same, it's obviously a lot smaller than the Defender 90, um, but, for the size, it's quite nice on the road. Like you're still higher up than say, like Fiesta or something like that. And I mean, yeah, it's even got lane departure warning here. It's, uh, it's just marvellous. It's it's got so many little gizmos on it, and it just it's really this car. They, I, I honestly, I'm struggling to hate it. I think it's incredible. It's like a little pedigree dog that's just, you know. <laughs> It's brilliant. I love it. I think it's. I think it's fantastic. Are so, you going one? No, because I've. I've. I'm financially ruined in a. Uh, in a Land Rover, and uh, I'm. I'm in very, very bankrupt. But as a. As an option, when. When it all goes to. All goes to pot, then. Uh, I'm certainly considering it. I think these are mint. And um, anyone who wants to get into the sort of four by four scene and not spend ridiculous swathes of money. I don't think you can go far wrong from this. I think it's absolutely meant. It, it rides comfortable. The seats aren't, you know, not bad. I think you could probably make a, a sick off-road, you know, stick some off bigger tires on it. Um, you've got, you know, like here, you've got selectable, you've got two-wheel drive high, you've got, you know, foot, low range, high range down there, little things like that. I love having a separate lever for that. And yeah, it's, you know, electric. It's got heated seats, aircon, front screen, rear screen, rear camera, rear sensors. It's, it's well specced. I'm, yeah, for what was it, 18 grand? About that. I think, you, it's, yeah, it's brilliant. Can't fault it. Can't fault it. 